Hey guys, and welcome back to Silent Hill 4, The Room. When we last left off, we found a new world. A building world. Yes. Yep, building world. Ah, well, if you didn't think the names of these worlds could get any worse. Building world. Hmm. Yeah. Anyway, we did find uh, a Sword of Obedience, which apparently disables ghosts permanently, which is pretty nice. Um, and we found a baseball bat, uh, an aluminium bat, which I don't think breaks, but I guess we're going to push it to the limit and find out. I've also been warned to watch Eileen, our neighbour, so not really sure what that's about. I guess she's going to be abducted and brought into this world soon hmm could be interesting anywho let's yeah so this oh yeah we had so I guess that's the way we're supposed to go but but we did find another way to go down here so let's go down this way first and cue big scary noise I think think you'd class that as scary. Not really sure what's making that noise, but I definitely want to find out. See how it likes the taste of my baseball bat. Probably not much. Well, that was a weird one. It's a little pathetic little moan there. Hmm. Okay. Oh, ghosty's back. Is that the ghost that we let up? I don't think so. I guess. Also, if we pin a ghost down and don't retrieve the sword, do we lose the sword when we move on to the next world? Kind of would like to know, actually. Hmm. Okay, what the hell is this? This is a bit weird. The fuck is that? Oh, we're in an upside. Yeah. I think. Is this room upside down? There's an upside down clock. The hands aren't moving. <clears throat> the doorknob is rusted shut and I can't get it open. So I guess we need to find something for that then. And there's sweet FA there. Okay. I mean, I knew we weren't meant to go this way. Uh, because we got the key, but it was worth checking. Could have been a, a big cache of supplies, you know. You don't know until you try. Although, knowing this game, that would be a massive negatory. Because we don't seem to get any kind of big caches of supplies. I mean, if you're lucky, you might find a handful of bullets somewhere. And by a handful, I mean literally ten. We still haven't used the handgun yet. Like, there's been no need to use the handgun. Uh, I want to. I was thinking about shooting off a few rounds off um, off camera, but you know, I didn't see the point. I'm guessing we just save it up for the boss. But then I say that, like save saving it up for the boss. I mean, it's just the handgun, you know. That's the way we came. We haven't found any other weapons though, have we? Oh, what the fuck? Oh, we got monkeys. You know what to do with monkeys. Come here, you dirty ape. Oh, how? Wait, what? How? How did you get up here? How did that monkey like just? I'm gonna have to watch that footage back. Hey, Pete. Oh, you're just a big old joke, aren't you? Squish. Next. Zap. Are you... S oh. <laughs> He's gone. Squish. Like, seriously? I love this thing, man. This bloody little zapperoo is a beast. Go away, phone. 
Me like. And it doesn't seem overly like. Is it, well, I say. Oh, hell. Hello. Oh, it's just these guys. Boop. Oh, this one's. This one's got some moves. Come on, monkey boy. Boop. Oh, you touched me and fell down. Squish. Come on. Come on, monkey. Beware the hand of man. They've got like little nuggets on their chest. That's kind of weird. But of course it's weird. It's Silent Hill. Oh. Okay, so we can go down there. But we've also got this. But it's locked. Because of course it is. This game certainly seems more linear than um, other Silent Hill games. Oh. Okay, so we've got like an arena down there. Won't open. Oh, that's an elevator. Okay, I didn't even think that was a door. Alright, well, I mean, I guess it is a door, which is nice. <gasps> Are we going for a boss fight? Probably not. Ah, that's that Richard guy. Are you the kid he was talking about? You live in that apartment too, huh? Say, you look a lot like a little punk that I once caught sneaking around there. Do you know something about what's going on? Hey, hey you, stop! Hmm. Are all of these people? Oh. Is that the only way out? Are all of these people, um... People that have wronged... Uh... Him in some way. And we've got some more handgun bullets. So, that's cool. Now, can we cheese this, I wonder? Well, they can try and attack us. No, nope, we can't. We can't hit them through the fence. Some games you can. Um. Oh. Okay. So. Wait a minute. Ah, oh, I wonder if now we can go up the other elevator. The elevator's not here. Can we call it? Okay, that's strange. Uh, oh, we've got a ladder here. Okay, well, I guess we can go down this one. Let's have a little poke around. We're going to take our zap and majig out because I'm quite fond of this thing. Can't really see much in here. It's very light. Ooh. Ah, we got the bloody things. Ooh. What's this? Our third health item of the game. Granted, like, health isn't a huge deal, because you can always just go back and heal. But, yeah, it's weird, man. Like, this game is so strange in a lot of ways. Can we do much damage? Hey, yeah, I mean, that works. It's not... It's not brilliant, but it works. This is really short ranged. And you're kind of just better off with these things just running into them. They don't do a lot of damage. Uh, okay. Should I go up? Yes. Yes, you bloody well should, Henry. Oh, we got monkeys. Ah, oh, this is the other side. We've got monkeys and dogs then. Locked from the other side. Come on, monkey boy. Boop. And squish. Give him the old boop and squish. Right, who's next? Definitely hear the dogs. 
Though this camera angles. Oh, hello. This camera angle is like very reminiscent of Silent Hill 1, where you get trapped and killed by the babies right in the beginning. Oh, God, hello. All right, Fido. Hey, get off me, you dick. Come on. Let's do this. You and me, pal. You and me. Boom. And we just missed the full charge. Sounds like there's more from down there. Oh, hello. Hey, buddy. Nice try. Yeah, so when you fully charge this up, it does significantly more damage. Like, it almost seems worthless if you charge it up, say, uh, nine-tenths of the way. It just doesn't do as much damage as if you let it charge all the way up. Just crazy amounts of damage. Good to know. Alright. Well, I guess all of these doors are fucked. There's a door back here we've missed. Apparently. Is that a door? Hmm. Oh, yeah, there's a door there. How the fuck are you meant to see that? I will never know. Come on, Fido. Come on. Come here, boy. Come here. Oh. Oh, I see. You have the dumb. You're also a monkey. Which means you get the zap. <laughs> it's just, like, what's the point? It's just too easy, man, honestly. Oh, Jesus. Okay, well, that's fine. You know, we can't be too hard on them, so there's no doors around here. Can we, though, unlock this somewhere? No. Ah, we've got a door there. Hmm. Okay, we can't go in there. Can we, like, smash our way in? No. Kind of could use a little top-up on health, to be honest. Don't really want to use my health drinks, though. Oh, fuck. There you go. How do you like some of that, you dick? Plenty more where that came from, Sonny Jim. Alright, well, he's down. Oh, you... I knew that was going to happen. Seriously? <sighs> Boop! Well, that worked. Squish! It's like they're carrying some weird unborn child with them. Boop! Ow! Oi! Oi! Calm down, buddy. You're gonna get yours, alright? No need to be greedy like. Squish! Stay down, motherfucker! Hey, monkey boy! Boop. It's getting close. Getting down to the wire, then. Man, I'm glad we found this thing. Oh. Wait, he's got a weapon. Oh. Well met, warrior. Come at me, bro. Huh? Eh? Huh? Eh? Boop. One hit kill. What? One hit kill. Damn. I should have backed off, really. So, note to self. The ones that have weapons do massively, massively more damage. Uh, let's just continue. I don't know where the continue is going to put us, mind. <sighs> uh, where's this? I've got to do all that again, haven't I? Oh, right, okay. In that case, guys, I will meet you back there in a minute. I'm going to... Um... God damn it. Yeah, I'm going to reload that in that case. Right, I'll see you back in a minute, guys. So if you go to continue, there's, there's, there's no point. You might as well just load the game. Noted. See you in a minute, guys. Hey guys, and we're back. Right, uh, we've just got this dickhead with his club. Let's see. 
There we go. We can make him swing at us. Oh, fuck. That does do a lot of damage. Now, is there a way? Yeah, okay. I guess we can just circumvent him like that. Now, can we get his club? <gasps> yeah, we can actually take his golf club. That's kind of cool, I suppose. Uh, it's a broken vending machine. That's interesting. But before I go in here, it looked like there was a ladder back there. Um, there is a ladder. Uh, but we can't use it. Okay, fair enough. Well, that just narrows it down a little bit. That's cool. So enemies that have weapons, we can take their weapons? Fair enough. I don't mind that. But man, they hurt though. Okay, so where do we go from here? Ah, stairs. Duh. Ooh, I don't like the look of this room. Ooh. Ooh, that's... That's weird, man. That's weird. There's something not right about that. Excuse me, controller. The batteries are fine. So don't give me your bullshit. Alright, so we've got up here. You know, the level design as well is kind of lazy. Lots of repeated areas. Oh, the leeches are back. Fuck off. And I mean a lot of repeated areas. Especially here. And have you noticed the environments just aren't that interesting? Like, uh, unlike Silent Hill 3 and Silent Hill 2, which had tons and tons of detail. Loads of stuff to search and explore. This game is just a low, it's just a collection of basically empty rooms. Hmm. You can certainly feel, there's no denying, just garbage, there's nothing useful here. There's no denying the quality has taken a massive, massive downturn. Now, that being said, I'm certainly still enjoying the game. It's fun. But, yeah, yeah. You can tell this this wasn't an A-grade effort. Uh, or even a B-grade. Wooden crates. Nothing interesting about that. Okay, so we've got three doors. Let's try all of the doors. Ooh. Ah, we've got to return home place. Let's go back. We're going to have to return home anyway. Because we're pretty beat up. Lock is broken. Lock yeah, see what I mean? Like, even when it looks like you've got a load of choices, you really don't. You can't really get lost. It's a rusty axe. Take the rusty axe. Yes. One-handed axe, a little short, but powerful and easy to handle. Okay. Oh, it's slow. Ooh, I like. Yeah, okay, we're going to use the axe. I mean, why would we use anything else but a fucking axe, man? There's a memo here. The boss said the number... This time is the last four digits of this store's phone number. But the phone number is written right there on the sign on the roof. I wrote that down right at the beginning of the game. Anybody could see it from South Ashfield Street. Is that really okay? Okay, so the code... For that door, I guess. We already have, which is rather spiffy. Let's have a look at this. Nothing we can do with that. It's a billiard table. Looks like they were in the middle of a game. Hmm. Alright. Well. Let's go get some healing. Before we do anything else. 
We've got a few, we've got about 10 minutes left on this video, I think. So let's go get healed up. I don't want to stop playing this game. That's the, I think that's the thing. Like, apart from the water level, uh, or the water prison level, I've re I have enjoyed it, to be honest. It's been fun. Um, you know. And there's not many enemies in this game either. I don't know if that's going to change uh, a little bit further on. I don't really know, but... Yeah, it's definitely been fun. Uh, let's drop that back. Items are still stingy as fuck. Like, three health items so far in the entirety of the game. Now, it is possible we've missed some. You know, but... I don't know. Uh, let's drop that back. And that back. And the, they're doling the weapons out kind of strangely as well. Like, we've had no new weapons for ages, apart from, I guess you could say the stun gun, but the stun gun feels very much like a, a hidden weapon, because it's easy to miss. Um, but apart from the that, haven't had any weapons for ages. And then we get two, like, back to back. Hmm. Got the superintendent going past again. Let's have a little check on... Uh, Eileen, Eileen. See what she's up to. Huh. She's still chilling on her bed. We'll leave her to it for now. Okay, so let's go back. I don't think there's any point in saving it. The individual levels as well, like when you know what you're doing, uh, obviously it's a bit different for me because... Um, this is all blind, but when you actually know what you're doing, the levels are very, very short. Which leads me to wonder how many levels there actually are. The writing on my pop filter is fading, but that's neither here nor there. Uh, right, so... Three, seven, five, two. Three, seven, five, two. Those are very, uh, these are very tactile and clicky. I like them. They're cool. Uh, zero. Very tactile and clicky. Then to be fair, it's not really much of a security risk, is it? Because you're never going to, you're never going to know that the phone number outside is the passcode. Okay. I guess Richard. Okay. Uh, it looks like we have an endless stair section now. Oh, really, really, game. Is it going to be like any enemies or anything interesting up here, or are we just going to be like running eternally? Oh, I can hear enemies. At least I think they're enemies. I hope they're enemies. I hope there's not just random sound. <laughs> Sound like zombies. Oh, it's the fucking ghosts. God damn it. Fuck this noise. Run! God damn ghosts. Yep, they're draining our health. And there's, like, literally sweet FA we can do about it. <sighs> really? Ah, oh, looks like we're at the top, anyway. Ooh, what's this? The door 207 from my apartment building. It's a plate. Ah, oh, so I guess this is the end. There's a plate on the end of the door. Yeah, let's remove the plate. Chaos placard. Okay, so we've got four of those cards now. Ooh. Oh, fuck. Oh. Yeah, never touch someone that's electrocuting themselves. 
We're being electrocuted. Shit. It's the one, t one, one, two, one man. Well, well, I guess there's another body hitting the floor tonight. Extra crispy. Hmm. Fried Dick. Because Dick is short for Richard. I don't know why Dick is short for Richard. But Fried Dick. Looks like another one, Captain. He's got one, one, two, one on his head. It's just like that case from 10 years ago. Yeah, that Walter Sullivan case. But Sullivan's dead. They even got the body. Must be some crazy copycat. Ooh. Yeah, but even so... Unless he's killing from beyond the grave somehow. Hmm. Let's have a look, because his apartment... There's a man in 207. He's pointing at room 203, which is next. That's got to be the killer then, because the kid did the same thing. So he must be saying, that's got to be the one that's doing it. Yeah, he's got to be saying Eileen is next, because we got a warning to say. But who's giving us the warnings? And why is he just standing there, pointing? Hmm. Let's go have a little look at Eileen. What a frustrating... Oh, she's getting dressed. What a frustrating place to have to stop recording for the, for the day. Hang on. Do I have time to do another episode? Five, three. So. Yeah, I got time to do another episode. Okay, so I guess she's like getting ready to go out, which is probably a good idea. Oh, I bet she's going to try and go out, but she can't go out. I bet that's going to be the thing. It's like, oh no, now I'm stuck in the 203. Okay. Well, what's happening outside here? Don't go out, Walter. Yeah, well, we're not Walter anymore, pal. Arguments, and there's another hand. Who's he having an argument with? Having an argument with Eileen? Can't see what they would argue about. Oh, and then it just repeats, I guess. Huh. And now they're gone. Hmm. Okay. Cool. So is she actually in there? Oh, I can hear her. Well, 
Oh, uh, she's obviously dressed up to go out. I mean, you wouldn't really dress something that fancy just for lounging around the the house. Would you? Mm, she's just pacing up and down. She seems troubled. Are strange things happening in her house now as well? Yeah, she's still pacing. Okay. Is there anything going on outside now? No, still nothing. Okay, right. Well, in that case, guys, I'm gonna save it. Yeah, I can't. <laughs> I can't put this game down now. I'm really enjoying it. Now we've got out of that bloody um, water prison, which I really did not enjoy that. So let's drop a save. So when we come back, guys, I guess we're gonna go back into the hole. I guess. I haven't noticed any any um, strange goings on. There's no notes or anything around. So that's what we're going to do. So thanks for watching, guys. And as always, till next time.